Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I wanted to film a setup of my Franklin Covey compact size in the Franklin Quest planner. And the reason for it is because I am going to, I purchased a medium XL GBO. Now this is a great binder. I purchased it from a buy sell trade group and I don't know the amount of rings it has in it, but I know my medium XL will be able to fit it. So right up front, I have this um, page protector with some gridded pages. Uh, they kind of are having a hard time sticking down. So I put this little piece of washi here. Um, I have pictures of my family members. Um, like right when I uh, open up, I like my binder to show personal stuff. So the tabs I have is home, weekly, daily, list, and family. In my home section, I have a lot of notes up front. I was trying to plan out this setup, um, home, weekly, daily, list, family, like what I wanted in each respective areas have an add to planner. I want to put some uh, 2021 holidays, a personal bound tracker, meaning like um, my bound tracker. It's in the back. So I kind of already did that. I want to put my passwords, um, print more monthlies. I don't need to because I found my Carrera. Label my tabs, acetate page markers, cut up some grid paper, and then move my permanent list here. So I do have these pages here. They're forward planner pages for me. I just want to be able to have in this planner, should I need to jot some things down that's further from what I have here in December or whatever, um, I have an area to do that. So these recollection ones have a lot of lists. I could technically move them to my list tab, but I kind of like to write lists and then when they become more permanent, add them over here. I guess I don't see these as permanent because um, once I fill it up, I kind of would just kind of throw it away. So I have a home wish list, real estate, planner, planner items I want, you know, things like that, and then purchases, stuff for my daughter, our son, my husband, and YouTube. Then I have a few other sheets. I also have an area for notes because I am gonna get an assistant kind of slash nanny slash, it's a part-time one. So I have some notes pertaining to that, a schedule, a sample day for me, sample day for that person. I'm just kinda, I did a job description. Um, I'm gonna do like sign-in sheets for when they come so I know their hours. So obviously um, I have a HR background so I can keep track of all that. And so in this area, it's my monthly. It's not necessarily miscellaneous. I just really love this because it has my family members. I took everything from my like main, main stuff over here for tasks and personal goals. This won't change. This is my main planner book, main you know hub. This is going to complement that book. So I put some of that there. I have my months and then I have May if I need to reference it, it's right here. These are the Carrera inserts from Franklin Covey Compact. And I do have the dailies. And at first I was going to use the dailies in here, but they just take up way too much space. So I'll show you what my daily workaround is. I do have this section for faith. I just want to be able to write scripture whenever I feel led to. So I kind of white out the dates and then I'll have my favorite scriptures in here. I have a monthly. I don't know if I want to use this, but it's there. Um, so then in comes my weekly. I have some to-dos, my bullet journal key, and I just really love this spread. My husband and I and our children, it just, oh my gosh, I love it so much. I wanted to use this for fitness and wellness area, and I had these old Marcia Bramucci inserts that I repurposed for that, and I was going to do steps mood and water but i found that that quickly does not work so i think i'm going to use this for homeschooling homeschooling's really not working over here maybe because it's summer but yeah i don't think i'm going to use that homeschool section in there this month 
So I have ideas for week on one page. It can track the weather, study schedule, exercise, YouTube, homeschool, anxiety. So right now I'm settling on homeschooling, but I have a bunch in here so I can figure it out as I go. The next set of weekly inserts are homeschool ideas and tracking Sophia's food. So that's what I'm using it for this week. Um, these inserts came from a planner friend when she sent me, I think, this binder or another binder. She sent me a whole slew of inserts for Franklin Covey Compact Size. So she made these along with some daily sheets. So this is what I'm using, these little quad ones, for um, homeschooling. And then I think that's all I have in there. Daily section. I have some reminders on what I need to do daily. I made this out of an old, like, I think the ends of a, okay, that's enough glue, best friend. Mommy, how old for more paper? Okay, go ahead and get some more paper. So I made this out of the end of a Target Dollar Spot notebook. Um, so I have a today marker and then my daily sections, I shot my stash and printed out Peanuts Planner Co, Row Row Designs, and then these are the dailies that the other individual made for me or gave to me. So I kind of rotated my dailies so I'm not stuck in one daily because I love variety when it comes to my days and um, I'm doing just that. What are you doing, best friend? Let me have it. Oh my gosh, just a minute. She's got like a whole page of glue. <laughs> okay. So let's put this over here so it can dry because that's a lot of glue. Um, so yeah, so I have those dailies like that. Okay, just a sec. And then I have some gridded for a bullet journal because sometimes I don't want to do a daily like this. Sometimes I just want to list just a bunch of things and not do like a schedule list and like all that so that's why I have that section and the list section this is what my tracker is for my bound books it's kind of showing me what I'm doing for the year in terms or what I've used um, when it comes to my bound books so I'm gonna be sixology for this month next month will be a standard stology I have some notes from Dakshina she showed me how to add a pic in iMovie one time and I kept it um, these are grocery guides. These are the personal size inserts, so I brought them over. I have some in some notes when it comes to school um, for real estate. I'm trying to get my license. I think I'm gonna have to extend my schooling some. So I have some more paper in there for other lists if I need to. The family section has our travel details and packing list and all of that for this upcoming travel that we are going to. I'm going to use these areas for packing lists for us right here. And then I have this section for my high schoolers. So once he starts high school, I know there's gonna be a lot of stuff required. I wanna put his bell schedule, student ideas, off days, his events. And I might type it up and put it in here. I might use these papers, I don't know, but that's the section for family. I've got um, pictures of my family and then page lifter. The one thing I love about Franklin Covey is the durability of the rings, um, just their, their, their quality of all of their binders. They've got big pin loops, they've got pockets galore. Um, they always have these bomb page lifters that I really, really love. <laughs> so yeah, I am gonna, I wanted to show you and document what I'm using right now because I'm sure it'll change Mommy, later. I'm using this paper. Okay. Um, but right here, I just have these little page markers and then I made a pin loop, but that's kind of how it came and they cut the pin loop off. That's how I purchased it. But I legit just have like a little pin leak thing right here. And um, I have my tool blue pin and then I have some page little lifters i know i use these a lot in like my dailies and my weeks have a whole bunch of stickers over here um and just this for some decorative 
Other than that, I really, really love this setup. I'm excited to get my new cover. This is at max capacity. <laughs> um, I really love stuffing my binders, but I thought I would show you what is happening um, as I go through my companions. I am a big believer in taking you guys along the journey but you can only have companions if you have a main planner system, in my opinion, um, or else you kind of feel lost. I have this main planner system, it's not going anywhere. It's aided me in my mental, spiritual, physical planning life. And, um, but I just wanted to show you what a companion in rings will look like for me. So if you have any questions, let me know. I thank you as always, as always, I thank you for watching my videos, supporting my channel. And if you're a new subscriber, thanks for um, coming along on my journey. God bless you.